Hey, how's it going, guys? It's me, the Flatter Sage. Oh, back again with another, another video, another discussion. Today, I want to talk about <clears throat> something that you may or may not agree with. And whether you agree or disagree, it's fine. It's your own opinion. But, I'm just here to bring this a little bit of information to light. Because I feel like it's not talked enough. And, uh, um, so what I, what I wanted to talk about today was, um, what's known as the Mandela Effect. Now, I know a lot of people have already talked about it in their videos on their channels and stuff like that, but I wanted to talk about it and give my own opinion about it, and um, there's a reason why I'm bringing it up as well, <clears throat> and the, re the reason I'm bringing it up is because, well, let me first explain what the Mandela Effect is, because there might be some of you that's like, what is that? Uh, I've heard about it, but I don't know what it is, but, so basically, it's a mass, um, a, a huge staggering number of people who remember a certain event a certain way, and I'm talking, talking about millions of people, like, um, national events or something like that, um, now, the reason it's called the Mandela Effect is because it was named after Nelson Mandela, who um, people um, thought died in 1991 or 1992, I can't remember, um, in jail. Um, but apparently, <clears throat> I think it was he died two years ago, something like that. Now, that's one that I'm not really too sure about because I, I was too young. You know, I was only like probably two years old or something when that, if that happened. Um, and I could have sworn I remember hearing something about Nelson Mandela when I was a little kid and stuff. Um, but it's not like people are just remembering. At first I thought that maybe this was just lots of people remembering these events wrong. But apparently... In the textbooks in Africa, in the schools in Africa, they actually state that Nelson Mandela died on 19, I think 1991 or 1992, I can't remember. It was one of those two. It was within those, that time frame. And, um, um, but apparently he supposedly died two years, I think it was like two, two or three years ago. Um, which is weird. Um, also, um... I'll give you guys another one. Um, a lot of you guys probably really remember this famous line in Star Wars. Um, um, the, you know, what does Darth Vader say to Luke Skywalker? The famous line. Um, what I remember, what I thought it was, was Luke, I am your father. <clears throat> Apparently, what it really is, is or what it's changed to is no i am your father um i'll give you guys one more or actually i'll give you two more examples there's too many of them another one is uh toy story um the movie toy story there's a famous line that um i think it's on uh the string i think woody has like a string or something attached to him and when you pull it, uh, certain pre-recorded th um, uh, phrases get said. And one of the phrases um, that I remember when I was a kid, because I used to love Toy Story when I was a kid, um, it was, um, there's a snake in my boots. Or there's a snake in my boot. Um, which, you know, would make sense, right? You know? However... What it is now, or what it's changed to now, 
is <clears throat> there's a snake in my boots, which doesn't even make sense. Um, another one is Forrest Gump. Um, I I love Forrest Gump. I thought it was a great movie. I watched that so many times when I was a kid. Um, and uh, sometimes if I see it, you know, on Netflix or wherever it is, I'll watch it. Um, and I always remember the famous line of that movie. Mama always says, life was like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. And um, I remember that because I remember kids at school were making that, were like um, saying that in the at school and stuff like that. Mom always said life was like a box of chocolates and like, um, you know, because you know how when kids are young, they say, they run around and say stupid shit. Um, and that was, you know, that was one of the things I remember hearing in the hallways of school and shit and stuff. I don't know why. Um, so, um, you know, I remember that. And another one, um, is, um, oh, have it, uh, it was a famous line in E.T., um, and I, I must have watched that movie so many times and whatnot, and, uh, my, my mom watched it before, because that was, um, because my dad took my mom to the movies to see that when it came out. Um, and so both of them remember that, and what we all seem to remember is E.T. phone home, because, you know, he's saying he wants to, wants to use the phone to call, to call so he can go home, basically. But what it is now, or what it seems to cha have changed to, is E.T., home phone which doesn't even make sense um and now now i'm gonna bring you to the the biggest one and the reason i felt like it was necessary to make this video um in the bible i can't remember i'm not sure exactly what verse i can't remember the exact verse but there's a certain animal that will lay with the lamb or there's a certain, um, hold on, make sure I don't accidentally say the wrong thing here, um, um, and it was a certain animal that would lay with the lion, and, um, what I remember is that the lion will lay with the lamb, but it's actually, um, I think it says the wolf will lay with the lamb, or the wolf will lay with the lion, um, which is very concerning. If you guys know that verse, what that verse is, uh, please look that up for me. Um, I remember the lion laying with the lamb. That's what I remember. Um, and, uh, I'm really hoping that it's not, it probably is, but I'm really hoping it's not Satan trying to, um, um, trying to mess with the scriptures. And, uh, that's, you know, that's why I wanted to bring that up because of that verse. Um, and, uh, I remember, I, and I was talking to Nick about it, and I remember talking to him about that, and I'm, it's like saying, like, yeah, I, rem I remember the lion would lay with the lamb, but apparently it's the wolf will lay with the lion, or something like that. <sighs> but, uh, anyway, guys, I just wanted to bring that to your attention, and, Try to find that Bible verse, um, try to look that up, and let me know what you guys remember. Um, um, 
and uh, sorry, it's a, I'm a little tired. It's a little late right now. But just look that Bible verse up. Um, let me know what you guys remember. And uh, I hope you guys have a great day. Peace and love.